Hello, my comic book loving sons of bitches, and hopefully Wonder Women that might be watching, welcome to this week's comic book haul. Uh, this haul was purchased on August 12th, 2017. I have a fucking itch. I think I got a bite. Yeah. Yeah, you, you didn't need to know that on a comic book haul video. Uh, it is summer. Though, I mean, bites are inevitable. Mosquito bites, hopefully non poisonous spider bites. Anyway, speaking of spider bites, man, Spider Man comic came out this week. Whatever, okay, let's let's do this. We got some comic books to show you guys. Um, I do have a confession, I, I, I seem to be saying this a lot lately. But holy shit, I did not read a damn thing this week. Technically, I read two pages of a comic. I had to put it down because I had stuff to do. Uh, I, I don't think I read a full comic this past week. Where did the damn week go? Uh, so, what my excuse or reasoning is the fact that I've been trying to set up a Twitch stream. Uh, so, the reason why I say that is maybe you guys might be interested in checking me out once I get it, you know, available, once I, once I get it down, you know, trying to work out the kinks with my computer and all that other stuff. I don't really know that much of what I'm doing, but hopefully, you know, you guys will check it out when I, uh, decide to do it. Um, follow me on Twitter, follow me on Instagram. And I will, and, and I'll probably Facebook too, I'll, I'll put updates on my Facebook, and uh, hopefully I can do some live shit, play some games, talk about some comics, if I start reading them, and uh, we'll see how it goes. But anyway, we got comic books to show. It was, uh, I don't know. I wouldn't call this a light week, but not like a gigant gigantic uh week. I mean here's the um the uh Undercity Hall and here is the the Comic Haven Hall. So I would say it was a pretty good week. Pretty Pretty hefty, that's a pretty heavy ride. So go ahead, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what I got. Uh three minutes in the video already, son of a bitch. So let's go ahead and just get started. Once again, shout out to the Conic Haven and uh, the City Comics. Both in Whittier, California. Both just awesome places to be. So yeah, let's go ahead and just get this started. Uh, we have, we start out with 985 of Superman Action Comics. This is pretty cool, pretty cool cover. Uh, Only Human, part one. Okay. Ah, this is actually really cool. Okay, so, what was it, a couple of weeks ago? Yeah, a couple of weeks ago, The Flash 27 came out. I only got the variant. Uh, because the comic Haven didn't receive it in time, but they did get it finally, and boom, I got cover A. I'm happy about that. That's a really good cover, too, so, very happy to have cover A for that. And, of course, this week's 28 came out, so we got the Flash, cover A for 27, and, uh, cover A for 28. Uh, so we have number 12 of Justice League of America. There we go. Yeah, yeah. Uh, 962 of Detective Comics. Mm-hmm. And we actually got a variant at, uh, at Comic Haven. Cover price, no extra charge. 985 of Action Comics, so I should have probably put that together with cover A, but that's okay. 
both both are really cool covers. I like I'm digging both covers stuff. Oh, here we go. Here's another here's a very I, I forgot, we actually got variants at the comic haven. Kind of a rare thing because they run out fast, they don't get as many variants as on the city does. So they were there and they were cover price, so we just said, you know what, why take a chance? And uh good thing because they did have the action comics I uh under city. I don't think they had this and this is not this is uh this is League of America. I actually think this is a better cover than cover A. So here's a pretty big one. Uh actually I'm actually pretty excited to read this one. I hope it's good. We have number twenty five of Captain America. There you go, the two captains. Go battle it out. Maybe. I noticed that even though the Captain America books have been intriguing uh, and kind of in some ways better than the uh, the core story of Secret Empire, they're also very woody, very little and or I should say very light on action and kind of need some action, you know. So. Marvel Comics in general have just been lacking excitement, really. So we got Deadpool Kills the Multiverse, uh, or what, the Marvel Universe, sorry, number three. Pretty sick cover right there. Um, it's like, I don't, know, I don't know if this is good or not. And I never read the first story. Uh, so I hope this is good. Marvel, uh, Deadpool kills the Marvel Universe again. Uh, I would like to read the first time he did it. So, maybe one day I'll do that. Um, I guess, you know what, I guess I'll just keep collecting that. Let it ride, let it sit. Maybe I'll try to find uh, the trade for um, the last one. Okay, anyway, number 23 of All New Wolverine. I kind of moved my camera off, so I'm like, I got more room to show the comic, and I'm not used to it. Uh, number 27 of Old Man Logan. I'm actually slightly higher, too, in case you can't tell. Um, my sister gave me a new chair. It's actually a hand-me-down. Uh, this was in her room. She actually got a new chair from her office, uh, her office building, they were going to get rid of it, and she brought it home. I actually want that chair. It's a nice gamer chair. This chair is cool and all, but holy shit. I'm still not used to how far it leans back. It leans back so far, and it, it freaks me out. I'm gonna have to read my comics a different way now because in my old chair I can sit back, I can lean back, and it wouldn't recline so so heavily. This one does. I don't know, man. I'll probably fall asleep. My old chair had tails and it was just getting uncomfortable. So I'm happy with this new chair either way. All right, so we actually have a uh, Superwoman number thirteen. That is badass. I like that cover a lot. And we did get the variant at Under City. So, nice little, uh, little, um, I don't know, double pack, whatever you want to call it. My, my comics are about to fall. Uh, so we have, hmm, what's going on here? The Girl of No Tomorrow. Ooh. Uh, number 12 of Supergirl. Which, by the way, I finished Supergirl Season 2. I thought it was cool. I heard that there was a mixed reaction towards it. I don't know why. I, I dug it. I thought it was really fun. Uh, number 153 of <clears throat> Venom. I really like this cover. I like that one a lot. It's a dinosaur. 
a dinosaur. We have a uh, Amazing Spider-Man number 31. Pretty cool, pretty simple, but effective artwork. We have Birds of Prey, uh, Black Girl in the Birds of Prey number 13. And uh, what is this called? Source, source Code Finale. Oh, okay. I don't know why, but it looks kind of like a variant, but it's, it's not, it's not. The Defenders, number four. I have to read number three, because it's got Punisher. Uh, I like this comic, so hopefully they keep up with uh, making it good. Number 25, a Harley Quinn. I don't know why I'm talking about that. Hi, Mr. J. I, I can't, I can't talk like uh, Harley Quinn. That is a brutal but clever and awesome cover. I like it a lot. I like you, Harley. Uh, number 13 of... Uh, where am I? I just, I just brain farted. I was actually gonna call it Redlands, cause the comic book actually came out this week called Redlands. But no, it's Red Hood and, and the Outlaws. What, what is wrong with me? Number 13. Shit, is this, is this how I'm gonna be? on stream, on Twitch. Shh. I'm gonna get a lot of concerned followers. I'm gonna be followed by psychiatrists. Okay, so this here is a special uh, Star Wars Cassian and K2SO Rogue One. I just, I had to have it. I was not sure if they would pull this for me at Undercity, and they didn't, but Back at Comic Cayman, I didn't want to take that chance, so uh, I got it from there. And lastly, from the Comic Cayman number eight, oh, I just zoomed in eight of Secret Empire. Look at Sam Wilson taking flight once again. That's awesome. I like it. Uh, yeah, I, I was actually reading, um, what was it? The comic that I told you I was reading, I only read two pages of, was Secret Empire number six. And I wasn't bored, I just, I had stuff to do. And not only that, it was like a really hot day, and my hands just could not stop sweating, so I had to, I had to put it down. I had to put it down, I had stuff to do. I haven't actually had a chance to go back to it, so... Secret Empire number 6 is where I left off. This guy makes a lot of noise. Stupid bag. But hey, I'm grateful they're still giving bags, because in California, you're not supposed to do that. You're supposed to be environmentally friendly. Check that off as a special note. It's a love note. <laughs> Fucking wish. Oh, uh, well. Uh, so now from Undercity, we have number 9 of 12 for Spirit Hunters. We have cover A, cover B, possibly. I don't know. See, I'm telling you, I'm not used to this angle. There's this slight change. That, I mean, we're talking about half an inch. Okay, maybe a couple of inches change of camera direction and height, and I'm not used to it. What an ass. So, Spirit Hunters, Spooky Dookie. Okay. <clears throat> I'm going to get this title right. It's like I can hear it in my head, but I can't say it with my messed up mouth. Sutherlands. Sutherlands. There we go. The Sutherlands. I finally said it correctly on a video. So we had number four on um, uh, cover A, cover B, what is it? <coughs> I don't know. I don't care. Number 11 of Star Wars, Dr. Alpha. Uh, 
Just relax. Don, I think you're right. The heat is getting to me. <laughs> like, it is totally fucked me up. No more 11. Oh, God. No more 11. 14. See? See? Titans. I'm almost tempted to stop getting this comic since I can't find number two and four. Uh, or is it two and three? I don't know. I don't even know anymore. But I'm going to get those goddamn comics. I'm, gonna, I'm going to read that. Okay, so this, I kind of liked it. It's simple, it's simple. And it didn't necessarily scream necessity. But it was there. And I haven't ran into a Variant for Detective Comics for a while, so I just decided to get the Variant. Cover B. And yes! Finally, I think I've missed like two two issues with, of not getting the Variant, and I'm not happy about that. So, I got a Harley Quinn Variant, issue 25, that is so great. What's the other one? Uh... The other one's already put away, but yeah. Got a nice variant of Harley Quinn 25. Uh, Naughty Naughty, um, what do you call it? You know what, see? I probably shouldn't have gotten this, actually. Uh, first of all, Naughty Naughty, um, Tom Haven for not pulling me this. Um, I've been thinking about stopping this comic. But damn it, these covers are so cool. Anyway, I got number 26 of uh, Hell Join and the Green Lantern Corps. Again, uh, I said this before, but I read these comics and I really don't even know what the hell I'm reading. All the names that they keep saying, it's like, what? Uh, I don't know, this kind of just kind of goes over my head. But it's so gorgeous. The artwork is gorgeous. Uh, once in a while, it just gets really exciting. Uh, I am missing an early issue, which is why I'm not currently caught up. Well, I'm not caught up on anything, but I'm, at a, I'm on hold right now because I'm missing number 12, I think. So, I gotta get that so I can continue on with this. Maybe it's gotten better. So, I guess I'll just keep getting it. And then, again, I rarely see a variant for Red Hood and the Outlaws. I found one today, so I figured, yeah, why not? Now this is awesome. This is the last one. This is awesome. I, I hope this comic is good, by the way. But I really love this variant. I think this is a great variant, and it's Star Wars, so yay. We have the variant to the Cassian K2SO special. And look at that, man. I, I just, I dig it. I love it. Cassian uh, and, and uh, K2SO running from the Empire, from TIE Fighters. That is just, I love it. I think that's so cool. I, it makes me happy. So guys, that does it for the whole, I know I, uh, kind of weird. I'm, I'm, I think I'm losing my mind. And I want to do this live? The hell is wrong with me? Anyway, that's it for the cover call. Next week is a big week. Metal. Metal. It's coming out, baby. Metal. It's coming out. There are so many beautiful variants. I don't know. What I'm gonna be able to get my hands on. I hate the fact that I can't go to the midnight um, uh, launch, I guess, that the Comic Cayman is gonna hold. They're gonna have all the midnight variants there. 
I don't know, man. I'm gonna hit up some fancy thing on the go. I want, I want those, I want those fucking variants. <sighs> anyway, I'm gonna go now. Before I, I don't know. Before I pop. All right, guys. Thank you for watching this video, uh, you know what, you have my permission to thumb this one down, cause this is gonna be a weird one, but if I made you laugh, it's so good in any goddamn way, please give me that like, I would appreciate it, uh, comment down below if you're concerned about my sanity, and, uh, I would appreciate that, uh, ain't gonna do nothing, still crazy, still gonna be crazy, but it would show that you care, and I'll appreciate that. Uh, never let anybody tell you too old to collect comic books, because if they do, then they may not be crazy, but they're boring, alright? Uh, please follow my social media links. Uh, again, I'm, I'm working on starting a Twitch stream. It won't be the greatest of quality, but I hope I can make people laugh at least. I don't care if they're laughing with me or at me, I don't give a fuck. Um, uh, alright guys, I'm gonna go now before I just, I lose about 50 viewers. Peace out, I'll catch you guys next week with some metal! Metal! Alright guys, that's enough. Peace out. <laughs>